Hello Internet and welcome to Drawing Tutorial. Today I'll show you how to draw a pick step. First you need to open up your Ibis Painty. Then you have to make this little this little circle, of course. Then you have to paint it a nice little red. Of course you still gotta do the circle also in a red. Try your best to make a little yellow dot in the center. Add some. Add noodle arm. Add another noodle arm. You can pose them however you like. But my example will be. Be one of his hands up in the air, other one down, like this. But, here's one little reference. One of his arms will look something like this. By the way, if you're wondering, this is Thor's hand little reference to the funny BFB of course you gotta draw it with five five little fingers or four if you're two so you need to draw five of course you gotta do the foot positioning and however your circles posed color in the little feet and the, the hand now for his arm let's do it a nice little nice colored for like arm blue then do the fingers that are closed in like that but if you have any um open fingers leave them as the current um nice little light blue colored now for the eyes first we do a circle a nice little circle if you want an eye closed that's all right you have to use a U. but if you don't want it to be a greater sign that's good too you can even leave both eyes open if you want them smiling something like this that's okay. Frowning, that's good. If you want a mad, you can do whatever you want. But for the example, I'll just draw him using this mouth. And if you want to add one of his little four eyes, that's okay too. Half and half, for the fun of it. If you're doing a four eye, leave one eye completely blank and just like the original picked up style but leave the other eye in four style and if you really want to do half and half then go for it draw a little line splitting across his face Then do that's not the side I wanted to do. I think I did the wrong side. I wanted to do the other side, the uh lefty side, because that's the one with the forearm. Again, if you really want to do this half and half thing, go ahead. Do whatever. As long as you make little pig step art, he would very appreciate it. Ugh. Make sure to erase any excess you have F over. Now it's time for my favorite segment.
Pain bucket torture. Eh, eh. Pain bucket torture part two. With a revenge. Re revenge? Re revenge? Re revenge? That was a bad pun, sorry. That is so cursed. Kind of looks like that half moon. Like a little. Like that cursed moon. Uh, ew. Like that cursed moon emoji. Now. If you really, 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 really want to go on that for detail, add this little weird cup thing. I don't know what it's called, but I'm going to call it that. And also, little outlineys. Because outlineys look cool. This is gonna take me a while. I am really trying my hardest right now not to fall asleep, but I literally woke up so early in the morning. I feel so hecking tired. Does anyone feel that too, or is it just me? But I don't care, because I'm still doing art. Don't worry, guys, I'm, I'm alive. I'm tired, just not dead. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Probably. Nah, dang, I missed a spot. Now I have to restart. Or not. Not to do this little wormy dealy thingy. Whatever. Add uh, this little thing. I don't know what I'm doing, but I, I'm doing. Then paint bucket the leg. And now we have the most cursed image ever. Pig ore part two. Now for the background thing. You can make it whatever you, color you want. I don't know. With like little details and whatever. But I'm just going to make mine light yellow with a little like lol. Just an X just marked at the bottom. And why not? I'm going to add little two dots and write it by, right next to it. Because, yes. And now for my actual favorite part, highlighties. For the highlights, I use an airbrush. Though I only highlight the pig step parts, because if I highlighted the four parts, that. Ew. So if you're planning to make this abomination, please don't make it more of an abomination by shading parts. Only shade the pig step parts. But if it's full on, full deal, take a step, shade them. Like crazy. And for even more detail, I'm going to make a little black hole in his hand. Mama, 
of course, the forehand will overlap the black hole. Something like that. The four fingers that did get this deal will have a gray outline instead of a black one so it doesn't blend in with black hole. Now for another favorite part of mine, a little more details because I'm bored, TM. I use airbrush particle L for like clouds and stuff, but today I'm using it for something different, black hole particles, because why freaking not? So I have to make this little weird wormy dealy over here, like a little wing or something. Make it enclosed and just scribble it in like absolutely crazy. Then make an outline for the little wormy dealy. Then add another wormy dealy to the other other side like that. Up, oh, I just eliminated one of four fingers. Don't worry, I'll add it back. Then we add another outline to the another weird wormy dealy thing. Now for blue hues, we add the blue inside the purple like. The original black hole had, but I'm not going full on detail. I'm just making it look as much as a black hole as I can. Because I'm really, really tired. Now for a little blue, little dark blue spiral thingies. I don't know what they're called, but I'm adding them. Because they look cool. Now for... Now for adding back... They removed parts using digital pen. My favorite. Remember how I said I would add back the missing forefinger? Well, I want it here. Because I'm too lazy to draw it where it originally was. A.K. where the black hole wormy dealy is going. So one of the new four fingers is going to cover um, the black hole wormy dealy, whatever it's called. That makes the black hole look cool. With all that said and done, we finally get to add our very last touch. A zap particle, cause it looks cool. But did you accidentally do this? Blech. Introducing Pen. Pen. Can you fix your little mistakes? Does your hand accidentally cover your arm? Digital pen can do that. Can cover that up. And there we go. A very, very cursed image. But at least it looks kind of decent. If you want to screenshot this... Wait, there's a little wormy dealy out of out of bounds, but I don't care. 
if you want to screenshot this to save as your very cursed profile for like a week or something, go ahead. As long as you credit me for your very, very cursed profile. But at least it still looks cool. Ish. Anyways, this is Pillager Slayer 64 or 60 picks up, you get the joke. Signing off. Later, Slayers, and good 